sisi uko sa daily sisi watu tuna let god tuna let tuna let god down daily day in day out by how we think how we talk how we reason how you talk to your friend by the way vitu zingine hata by kuguza kufikiria you know we have mistakes every day every time every hour and by god's grace that's why we live that's why tuna survive that's why god anabaki kwa god kwa life yetu hata ukimkosea bado anabaki like bado ni mtoto wangu you know lakini that's why we say god si ka binadamu juwe hey nani angekupatia hiyo second chance unamkosea ya kwanza ya pili ya tatu kidogo amekurusha nje unakosa kulipa rent first month second month ya tatu unaenda nje unalala kwa street cuz god is not like human beings unamkosea leo unamrusha nje leo unaongea vibaya leo unaona ah Mungu alini promise sasa hata amechelewa you know Una, unaongea vitu mingi but ukienda tu muombe msamaha kwangi like kama binadamu so ulinikosea last month so ulinikosea hata jana akwangi hivyo once he forgives he totally forgets and he is always urging us to forget once you forgive and i have a strong topic today low topic ni fire eh fire and the topic is he remains to be god in everything that's why natupatia nafasi nyingine even in that destruction he remains to be god even in that sorrowful situation ile una feel to ah inayo mina chana nayo kwani iko nini inayo sitambui waseme wasiseme ah mina chana nayo even in that situation he still remains to be god we're going to read the verse um, the book of isaiah chapter 43 from verse 1 to 3 the book of isaiah chapter 43 from verse 1 to 3 and it says fear not for i have redeemed you i have called you by my name sorry fear not for i have redeemed you i have called you by your name you are mine tunse kwanza tufikishapo god amesema wewe ni wake do you need anything else <laughs> do you need anything else by the way utaji kwa na mse mwingine anakwambia ama mtu mwingine anakwambia ti we ni wangu a a what god has said in the book of isaiah 43 verse 1 that you are his that is enough remember he is the creator of heaven and earth he is the giver of life he is the giver of everything everything that you uko nayo everything that you are today be it umeokoka ujokoka by the way kwanza kama ujokoka hiyo ni deni automatically uko na deni hiyo ni a straight for lisa eh automatically imagine he says that you're his no matter how you are whether you're talented or not whether you are brave or not whether you're wise or not whether you love him or not wewe ni wake in the word of god he says he created us in his image and likeness so hata hii ni ile unasema nga biologically hata uwezi mlenga uwezi mkana hata kama umtambui uwezi mkana cause you actually look like him verse 2 it says When you pass through the waters I will be with you and through the waters they shall not overflow you When you walk through the fire you shall not be burned nor shall you nor the nor shall the flame scorch you In amani shaje When because God has said you are his Ato pitie kwa mtu Mtu inaweza kuwa ni mashida mtu inaweza kuwa ni fracas mtu inaweza kuwa tu i yani a lot of drama ushaka hivi kwa life yako kila kitu iliko ina work vile inafaa then all of a sudden issues from from nowhere mara maybe ni jirani oh ule kabaket vibaya mara ule nika nguo yako vibaya mara ni job unapata ni colleague wako ako like ako tu na issues unapata ama maybe yo so times you utapata tu situations zinakukuta uko like tulifika hapa lini tulifika hii position lini hizo ndo tunate hizo ndo water hizo ndo rivers and god says even when you're walking through the rivers the over the overflowing rivers you will not drown 
haita kumeza haita haitafanyo suffocate haitafanyo issue nguvu you know when you're walking through that situation you're broke mpaka pesa ya nyanyani tricky kupata and unafeel hata aibu kuomba bestako kuomba ivo atikupigevo ni aje manzi sina 20 bob cuz unafeel ndombaje 20 bob even when you're in that situation god says in his word that when you pass through the waters i will be with you and through the river they shall not overflow you so your situation haita ku over haita ku overtake ama haita kufanya u feel weak like you will not haita haita kuwa difficult for you go to go back to normal so you'll go through the situation which is okay cuz god lazima ji glorify na your situation lazima ajitukuze kupitia hiyo situation unapitia but imanishi hiyo situation itafika to a point itakufanya ushindwe hata kupumua itakufanya ushindwe hata kufanya ku move on with life itatitafanya ufikirie tu kuhusu suicidal thoughts apana god has said cuz you are his you should not be afraid so even tuambiango in the book of psalms 23 when you walk through the valley of the shadow of, of death you should not fear any evil cuz he is with you that is in the book of psalms 23 and in the book of isaiah 43 he says you should not fear because he has redeemed you he suffered because of you he died on the cross because of you yeah hakuwa na atia by the way yesu alitoka heaven through the holy spirit is now born through mary through mary he is now he is now being taught in the altar hata wenye alikuwa anamfunza kwa altar wako anajua yeye ni Yesu but the instincts instincts zilikuwa tu wanampenda tu wanamfunza tu wanakaa na yeye jona hata wanakaa tu na yeye and he died he suffered he was crucified beaten alivalishwa kofi ya throne ya thorns it's not because he did any mistake kuponya mse ugonjwa eh kuna vile hiyo ni mistake kupea 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 watu food ku multiply food bread na fish haikuwa mistake ku change water to wine haikuwa mistake anto okay ukitembea na god like when you go through these things that is not difficult for him to sort you out ata ku sort vile inafa cuz god is god He yes he is a supernatural being but he is your father and he says wewe ni wake Mimi I think mimi nikiambiwa hivyo vile tu ameniambia hivyo yeye nitosha I think when I go through issues ndakuwa tu like ulisema mimi ni wako so wewe ni sort Kama mimi ni wako sifai kupitia hii Kama mimi ni wako sifai kusikia uchungu hivi Kama mimi ni wako hizi vitu napitia inafaziishe Kama ni issues jo, ni sort kama ni watu wanaku unaona kuna team tu watu tu wako kila mtu tu wako story zake amekutafutia issue mwingine issue mwingine issue a uh-uh. a leave it to god there is one thing mimi usema mi my bishop alituambia hii mwaka we should not fight for ourselves so i'm encouraging you hata uko ujue church yangu of course maybe tunaenda tofauti church tofauti but please take my faith walk with my faith You should not fight for yourself. He's a victorious God. Sinacha Limba, victory is your name. Because he she knows that victory, God has shindangui. Ushisiki ameshindwa vita. Kama mauti alishinda, ni hizo situations zako ndo atashinda. My brother, my sister, hiyo situation yako, hiyo ni kidogo. Alishinda kifo. Hakuna mtu ashaishinda kifo hata wenye wanasema sijui ni miungu zile miungu zinatokeleza zinatokele ngatu from anywhere so unajua kuna hizo miungu tu the any people set them knowing that there is god but they they use them to mock god if god alishinda kifo nini niaweze kufanya that should be actually your motivation that god said you are his and he has redeemed you so hata hiyo situation haitafanya ukufe moyo 
actually inafa kupeleka the next level and the last verse it, she, it says for i am the lord your god the holy one of israel your savior he's giving you an affirmation that when you pass through the waters he will be with you when you walk through the fire you shall not be burned for he is god your god the holy one the, of the holy one of israel your savior i think at as fake we explain more than i've explained i've given you one example one powerful example alishinda kifo sembuse kile ambacho unapitia hiyo ni kidogo sana what you're going through is a small thing it's a drop in the ocean na hiyo ni kitu kidogo sana just know whatever you're going through ni kitu kidogo hata kama unalia day in day and day night i know i'm talking to somebody back there at home kuna mtu tu mahali maybe life imefika mwisho hana hana mbele hana nyuma hana mtu akupigia hana relative anaweza pigia msaidie hana jirani anaweza ambia shida yake tell god talk to your father anasema wewe ni wake alisha ku redeem so tell him dad mimi napitia hii shida ni sort atakusort for as long as you have faith in him atakusort so my brother my sister god remains to be god in everything in happiness in sorrow in sadness in tricky situations he remains to be god even in our situation in the country at the moment he is still god imagine ajahama kwa kiti yake ako bado tu kwa ile kiti chake cha enzi malaika tu wako pale wana inama wakiinuka wana inama wakiinuka because he is still god hata tuandamane hata tubebe vitu juu god remains to be god even when economy is tricky God remains to be God. Even when you hapo nyumbani maybe unashindwa kulipa rent, maybe umeshindwa watoto walikuwa narudi shule Tuesday. Maybe wako hajarudi. Juna school face. Just trust in God. He is a faithful God. And wewe ni wake. So ako ni baba yako lazima akusort. So mwambie tu no muamini atakusort because he says he is the Lord your God, your savior. The holy one of Israel. Mwachie acha kupiganie and that will be it sitaongeza ingine i'll not add anything sitatoa toa mi hiyo acha hiyo acha ikusort kwa sababu that is that is straight to the point god amekuwa sure i hope you have learned something i hope utaitumia vizuri hiyo weekend in that situation that unapitia mwachie acha kupiganie modhoni wa wangari god bless you so much my sister um na mwana pia Kerry Leni Kerry Lee watching na joyo ni rafiki yangu ambaye anaitwa Gladwell Maina God bless you so much Dorcas Marsh thank you so much ukiwa upande wa Dhika Makongeni God bless you so so much Modoni wa Wangari thank you so much ukiwa upande wa Ruisambu na kuona sana God bless you Mary Hector thank you so much from Gaturi God bless you so so much Mungu zima azidi kukubariki ah, napenda kuata ningependa kutambua wengine Um, pia namuona Anthony Kamande God bless you so much na kuona pia Rini Nyambu God bless you so much my sister naona pia Amos Langat ne hao nilikuwa niwapitia tu nikiwataja taja Mohoni Rose God bless you Vero, Vero Prince God bless you so much Beth Mwatha thank you so much and God bless you Geoffrey Gathiru Jeff Chege Tumbi thank you so so much 